don't scroll. You need to hear this whole message. Don't scroll. You better not scroll. Not only is this the exposing season, this is integrity season. How much integrity do you have? How much integrity do you have? How much integrity do you have? How much truth do you have? How much spiritual truth do you have? That should be a thing. Spiritual truth. Because some of y'all ain't got it. Okay? Um, but a lot of you do. Most of the people that follow my page and who are diligent with their spiritual practices have spiritual truth. <laughs> Confirmation. Good Lord. Um, but this is the season of integrity being tested. Because someone's finances might be might be being attacked. You might have delays on deposits. You might have half of what's supposed to get on your deposit in your bank account. You might have nothing supposed to, is nothing in there that's supposed to be there you might have nothing in there and it's supposed to be something in there there you go um but here, this is when the integrity comes in this is when your spiritual truth comes in because you have to go and to the proper people to say what's going on what's going on what's going on how you approach the situation is going to determine what you get if you go in there acting motherfucking crazy you're gonna get crazy in return if you go in there acting like you got some spiritual truth and use your words properly then you're going to get what you're supposed to get. People are attacking different sectors of things. They cannot attack They cannot attack your, your body now and your heart chakra, your throat chakra, your sacral chakra. That cannot be attacked. So what do they do? They go after your finances. They go after your home. They go after things breaking your house, flies in your house, your friends. People don't call you no more. People don't want to hang out with you. People dropping off like dead people. That's what they go to. So they can't attack your vessel anymore. They're attacking, like I said, your finances, your home. People might be looking at you crazy. You might be getting weird looks from people. You might be getting into arguments with your neighbors, arguments with your lover, arguments with your, your parents, your family. That's what they're attacking now because you are too powerful. They cannot attack you no more. So they said, what's the next best thing? Attack her finance, attack his finance, attack the bills because they want to attack your bills. You know the bills you got to pay. That's what they're doing. Okay? <laughs> so don't be scared when... But how am I gonna pay this? How am I gonna pay that? I got this. I got this on the bill extension. That on the bill extension. They tell me I can pay this. Blah, 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 blah. This I'm robbing Peter to pay Paul. All right, calm down. Like I said before, my other post. Just before things turn around for the better, it's gonna get a little crazy. It's gonna get a little stressful. That's how it be. Just before things get better, it gets a little hectic. It gets a little stressful because it's not really stress because you handle it. You've been through much worse, okay? You've been through the ringers. Yeah, well, that's the end. The ringers. Not the ringer. The ringers. <laughs> so you can handle this little, your check being late. Your bank account being a little empty because where did the deposit at? He ain't call you back. She ain't call you back. F him. Gave your number out to a girl. Gave your number out to a guy. They acting silly. Fuck him. That's the attacker now. Other things that are not of you. They cannot attack your vessel anymore. Your vessel is highly protected, highly guarded, highly anointed, and they cannot attack it. So they're pissed. So they're going to the next best thing. It's things that are attached to you. Even people you might have known for a long time might be looking at you like you're crazy. Or might be falling off from you. Don't want to talk to you. Let them fall. Chip on. Twirl on. <laughs> Goodbye. Light some frankincense and myrrh. And it's in the Bible, so don't say nothing about that, okay? And so those crystals in the Bible too, but them tarot cards in the Bible. Uh, <laughs> I'm joking, you guys, but that's really true. Um, spiritual clean your house. Drink your lemon and lime water. That will help your vessel. It doesn't only help your stomach stay flat. It helps other things. You can also boil lime and lemons in a pot on your stove and let it boil all day. All right. Goodbye.